At last, Pinnock is nearly veiled. Why, it's only a short matter of time until we ascend. One can only imagine what it will be like on the other side. Initiating final phase. Hello, Deandy. Ah, your lists. Always with the lists. After all these years, I'm astonished you haven't memorized the process. My apologies, Lord Commander, but it is these very lists that ensure your carefully laid plans unfold with such precision. Varelsi and Thrall forces deployed on the ground. Sources report that all five factions are nearly overrun. Generate technicians are spinning up the heliophage. Full power in three macrons. Varelsi portal opening in 45 microns. Tell me, spy mistress, how many veilings have we witnessed? That depends on your classification, Lord Commander. Do you mean to count all those that we have witnessed since the Varelsi appeared in our universe, or after our, um, alliance? Since I ensured the survival of our people, spy mistress, something the Empress would have never accomplished. Pinnock will darken within the hour. Pinnock will make our 301st veiling in five years, marked by the Second Battle of Jenna and your agreement to the passage. And the illustrious beginning of the Generate Imperium. So much accomplished in such a short period of time. You do realize, Deandy, that your list will soon be of no use. Our work is nearly complete. Pinnock will be nothing more than a dark stain in a matter of microns, and soon, too, will Solus fall into the dark. After the darkening is complete, we will move the Heliophage to Solus immediately. With the current state of the opposition, our Thrall forces on Tempest should make short work of them. Good it's worth. Information has done little to save our world, not the fate of the Empress, nor stopped the darkening of even one of those 300 stars. From countless stars, billions illuminating the galaxy. Now, only two left. I'm out of time. The passage must not be completed. Um, excuse me, Lord Commander. There appears to be a situation on the ground that I must deal with personally. Indeed you must. Farewell, Deandy.